Did you know that the successful launch of Chandrayaan-3 put India on the global map in the field of space and science? A riveting tale of technological triumph, the Chandrayaan-3 mission soared beyond the clouds and into the annals of space exploration history. Crafted by the brilliant minds at the Indian Space Research Organization, or ISRO, this mission not only reached for the moon but also the stars, garnering recognition from the global scientific community. August 2023 marked an important event in this saga. A delegation from NASA's Jet Laboratory journeyed to the ISRO headquarters. Their mission? To delve into the yet cost-effective technology that powered the Chandrayaan 3's successful soft landing. As they navigated through the intricate instruments, their awe was palpable. The ingenuity and affordability of ISRO's technology had indeed made a lasting impression. The Chandrayaan-3 mission not only marked a major milestone for ISRO, but also caught the attention of NASA. This was just the beginning of a thrilling space odyssey. Don't forget to subscribe for more exciting space stories. Following the successful launch and landing of Chandrayaan-3, ISRO received an unexpected proposal from NASA. A delegation from NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, or JPL, visited the ISRO headquarters in August of 2023. Their purpose? To get a closer look at the technology that powered the Chandrayaan-3 mission. After a detailed walkthrough of the mission's technology, the NASA scientists were left in awe. They marveled at the advanced, yet cost-effective, scientific instruments that ISRO had used. The mission's technology was not just impressive, it was also affordable. This was a combination that even NASA, with its deep pockets and extensive resources, found attractive. ISRO's chairman, S. Somanar, recalls the conversation with the NASA delegation. About five to six people from NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory came, and we explained to them about Chandrayaan-3 technology, he said. They just said, we have no comments. Everything's going to be good. They also said, look at the scientific instruments. They are so beautiful and very cheap. They are very easy to build and they are advanced. How did you build it? Why don't you sell this to America? These inquiries were not just about the scientific instruments, but also about the unique approach and innovation that ISRO had brought to the table. It was a moment of pride for India's space research organization. The world's leading space agency was not just acknowledging, but also expressing interest in their technology. NASA's offer to buy ISRO's technology was not a business proposition. It was a recognition of the strides that India has made in space research. It was an acknowledgement of the ingenuity and resourcefulness of Indian scientists. It was a testament to the progress made by India in the field of space research. So, what does this mean for ISRO and India? It means that India has firmly established itself on the global space research map. It means that India's space technology is not just competitive, but also desirable. NASA's offer to buy ISRO's technology was a testament to the progress made by India in the field of space research. ISRO's success with Chandrayaan-3 has opened up new possibilities for the future of space technology in India. This accomplishment has not only put India on the global map, but also served as a beacon of inspiration for the younger generation. ISRO Chief S. Samanath's words resonate with this sentiment. He encourages students to contribute more to India's space technology, highlighting that India is now capable of building the finest equipment, devices and rockets. Samanath's vision for the future of space exploration is both ambitious and inclusive. He believes that one day, an Indian student, potentially a girl, will design a rocket that will carry another Indian to the moon. This prediction is not just about technological advancement, but also about breaking gender barriers and promoting inclusivity in the field of space exploration. In line with the ideology of the former President Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam, Somanath urges the youth to dream and believe in their potential to reach the moon. Such a vision fosters a spirit of innovation and exploration among the younger generation, fueling India's progress in space technology. The successful soft landing of Chandrayaan-3 on the lunar surface was a monumental achievement that has set the stage for more ambitious missions. With the success of Chandrayaan-3, the future of space technology in India looks promising as it continues to inspire the younger generation to reach for the stars.
The journey from the successful launch of Chandrayaan-3 to NASA's offer to buy ISRO's technology has been an inspiring one. This tale not only ISRO's significant achievements, but also underscores the global recognition of India's advancements in space technology. As we look to the future, the potential of India's space research is promising and boundless. The story of Chandrayaan-3's success and NASA's subsequent offer is a testament to the progress made by India in space research, inspiring a new generation to dream big and reach for the stars. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and reach for the stars with us.